Hey guys and welcome to another video. In today's video we're taking a look at this bad boy right here, the Blue Snowball Ice. Let's take a look if it's still the best budget option for streaming, YouTube, content creation, podcast, whatever you want to do with it, even gaming in 2020. Let's take a look. Oh, and if we have not met before, uh, my name is Luke, by the way. I'm a full-time content creator. You can find all the links for support, for socials, for whatever you want to do with it down in the description below. Six months ago, when I got into live streaming, link down in the description, I got the Blue Snowball. And I didn't really do much research about the microphones because the Blue Snowball was on sale for $30 and there was nothing else out there on Amazon that time that could really compete with it. So I went for it. And I still have it. But let's give you my pros, my cons, my thoughts, and some alternatives at the end of the video. Let's start with the pros. First out, it is a great microphone to begin with. It's cheap. It sounds amazing out of the box. There's no software, no setup required. You literally just plug it into your USB slot and you're good to go. And it comes with a small tripod so you can mount it on the tripod and somewhat decide where you wanna put it at least. Besides that, the Blue Snowball is known by literally anyone out there. You will never run into the problem of having something go wrong with the microphone and then going on YouTube to find out how to fix it. It is so popular, there's a how-to and a fix for everything out there. But that is all about with the pros. Let's get to the cons. The tripod that I mentioned that comes with the microphone, which is really great to set it up and put it wherever you want. Yeah, it's about this long. It doesn't really get the microphone anywhere close to your voice. So you need to invest in a microphone arm in order to make the blue snowball only pick up your voice and nothing else. Otherwise, if you only use the small tripod and you put it close to your keyboard, it will definitely pick up all the keystrokes and all the mouse clicks. Besides that, the Blue Snowball only picks up what you speak directly into it, which can be a good or a bad thing. But if, for example, you have this mounted on a tripod or on an arm like I do, and you have the cable pull the microphone in a different direction just a little bit, so every once in a while it turns, the sound quality suffers immensely because you can only speak right into the front right here and that's about it. If you speak in the back, good luck with that. And the last downside of the microphone is the shape. I mean, yes, there are microphones that are ball shaped out there, but this big, it's a huge microphone and the shape, uh, that, that it's pretty hideous. It doesn't look that pretty on stream and it takes up quite a big of space like in front of your face. So would I buy the Blue Snowball again? A absolutely, absolutely. If it's on sale again for $30, it's an absolute no brainer. You won't get a cheaper mic for that. But if I have the option and Please, by the way, don't pick it up on Amazon right now. I believe it's up to $100 because of the current situation going on. Uh, go somewhere else. Right now, the best option is really to check your local stores rather than Amazon for any kind of mic or any electronics at all because local stores might still have some and they're not jacking the prices up the way Amazon does. Um, so keep that in mind. Anyways, will I buy it again? Yes. If I have the option for something else, I will go for something else. And here are some options. Uh, but by, by the way, I stream on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 10.30 a.m. MST. Uh, links down in the description below if you're interested. Just, just saying. The first one that is kind of in the price range of the Blue Snowball as well, between the $30 and $45 mark that I was also still able to find on Amazon is Fifine. Fifine does some microphones, they're condenser mics, it's the same thing, you plug it into the computer and you're good to go. But they pick up your voice from all around and they're not as bulky and big as this Blue Snowball. So if you want to stay in the price range, let's say $50 and below, Fifine is probably your best bet. If you have a little bit more money to spend upwards between the $100 mark, I would go for the HyperX Quad Cast. The HyperX Quad Cast is an amazing microphone for in the like medium to higher price range and is used by so many streamers. It sounds absolutely amazing. It also has the nice option of just tapping the microphone to mute it. If anyone ever comes into your room while you're streaming or you have a phone call, something going on, you simply tap the microphone and you're good. And the last microphone, if you want to spend upwards of $200, the Elgato Wave 1 or the Elgato Wave 3 will be your best bet. The quality and the sound of the Elgato Wave is absolutely mind blown. And the software that it comes with allows you to make all the tweaks to fill your needs, whatever you want to do with the microphone. So if you have the money, let's say upwards of $200, again, out of stock right now. I'm sorry, with the current situation, it's kind of hard to, to even get a microphone in the first place, but the Elgato Wave 3 will be your best bet 
in the high range option. Just to sum the video up though, the Blue Snowball, it's a great beginner microphone. If you just wanna plug it in, don't have to worry about anything, I would definitely go for it again. And even for $15, you get a microphone stand. It's not too bad. Anyways, if you found the video helpful, guys, make sure you smash the like button down below. It helps out the channel a lot, helps the YouTube algorithm to push the video even further. And if you share it with your family, your friends, let's say maybe even your dog, it will help out the channel even more. Every Wednesday and Saturday, I upload a new video. Links down in the description if you want to sup. And um, hit the bell so you get notified. Have a good day, guys. Stay awesome, stay hydrated. I'll catch you next time.